Ladies and gentlemen, KJ here, and I'm back with another episode of Minecraft Let's Play. And today, ladies and gentlemen, it is a glorious day to be here because I've decided that we are going. Um, well, I was hoping I could find it. Now I'm just looking stupid, looking up way up into the air. Dude, it, it like messed up my intro. I was going to have like a perfect intro here and everything. And you guys are all probably like, what are you doing? Like really, what what are you doing? The stupid clouds have to be here though. Um, I was going to say, you know, we are going to go and look up and see the moon. And be like, to go to the moon. But uh, the clouds or the game just decide not to... Not to work with me here, and there is no moon. Oh, unless that's it. Is that the moon up there? That might be the moon up there. I don't know. Well, good job, game. You, you screwed up my intro. It was going to be perfect. It was going to be great. Instead, it, I, I look stupid now. Um, <laughs> I decided to start working on some Galacticraft stuff in this episode. Um, so as we can look, Galactic. Craft. There is a lot of Galacticraft stuff. Um, I kind of have an idea of what we need. We do need a rocket. And so the thing we need is, of course, a tier ro 1 rocket or... Oh, they come with equipment slots, too. That's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, we need a tier 1 rocket, so we need to fill out these little spaces here, and that's how we get the rocket. So we need, like, fins, we need heavy-duty plates, which is... Bronze, aluminum, steel, all of them are compressed. To compress it, you need a compressor, um, which is up here somewhere. Somewhere. Here we go. Um, compressor, electric compressors. Uh, out of our range right now, we need compressed stuff to make that. Um, but we need a wafer, which a wafer is made with a fabricator. So that is actually where we start. We start with a circuit fabricator. As you can see, we need a furnace, uh, a lever, two buttons, some aluminum, a uh, redstone torch, and then aluminum wire, which is aluminum surrounded by wool. I think we have the wool, right? We have aluminum, but unfortunately we don't have any smelt it up, so I'm going to get that started right now. Throw in the gravel, and then the ores that we have left over here. Boom. Get that going. I'm actually surprised we don't have any aluminum, but we don't, so... Whatever. Do we have wool at least? We only have a total of four wool. That's not going to do much for us here. So we're going to need some shears. Luckily, we have our sheep farm. So we can go and get some more wool. I know there's some in, like, the area over there, too. So I guess I could go over there and shear some of them. But this will probably do for now. 14, I need... Yeah, that'll get me... Two, I think two, which is I think what we need. Now I don't know if this stuff is electric. I know there's electric variations of them and not, but I don't know if they work with RF. I was seeing, um, what is that? Some J, oh, GJs, which is Galactic Jewels, I think, or something. So that's going to be a little bad if they don't work with um, RF, because we kind of need them to work with RF. That's the only source of energy we have. Because that's usually pretty universal for everything, so... We will see and, and hope that it is universal for this as well. Smelt up a whole another batch of this stuff here. I'm glad I have three of these basins that can just, like, pour out, like triple as fast. I clear that out. Put that, and then that, and then fabricator. Where did the fabricator go? 
Oh, Mr. Fabricator. Okay, so we need that. Oh, it makes six of them. Ha! Huh. That is beautiful. That is very, very beautiful. Now, what what are we missing here? We're missing everything. Okay. Um. So lever, lever. We'll make a couple levers because you know levers are always good to have. Um. Redstone torch, torch. We need a redstone one. Do that. We need a furnace. We should probably make a couple of these, because I'm always having to make the furnaces anyway, and then, then I then I don't have them, and so it's like, oh, okay. So we'll just make like ten furnaces. That'll be good. And then a button. Button. We'll make a bunch of buttons. Ten of those as well, so we have them. When we need them, and select the craft circuit fabricator, and we now have it. Okay, so let us see if we can hook it up to this stuff, because that would be that would be very very good if we could hook it up here. Can we can we hook you up? Hello, hook 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 it up, hook it up. You you don't want to be hooked up. No, you don't. You don't want to be hooked up. That's that's an unfortunate thing. Oh, is, or is that the thing? Do I have to do I have to do it like a certain way? Is it one of those ones where it needs to be put down a certain way? Otherwise, it's not going to work. Okay, jump, shift, click. Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. I hate it when they do that. I'm sure there's probably a wrench that I could use that will f um like work for that. You know, so that I don't have to do that all the time. But I just hate it when they have to be hooked up a certain way. And then you don't know. I also don't like that you can't really see it here. But, eh. Eh. It is what it is, I guess, you know. Um, we're going to need more of these. Do we have any more of these? Conducts. No, we do not. Although we do have the conduct bindings. Or conduits, I think they're pronounced. I don't know how they're pronounced, man. Oh, I don't know if we have any of that stuff. Oh, we do. Hey, we actually probably have a lot of that stuff. We have full eight here, so, you know. Okay. Move. All right, I think everything but the last one now has it. Girl, you, you really need to, like, move, though. Come over here. Cause you're in the way over there. Come over here. Come over here. Come, come here. Come, come, come with me. The girlfriend is in the way. Thank you. Maybe just a little bit more. Or not. Whatever. I don't care. You're at least out of the corner, so I can at least access this stuff again. Okay, yeah, it's it's in there, so then we just put that there, and we're good. Okay. We now have power in all those places. So, circuit fabricator. Now, we need diamonds, redstone, I think it showed there, and a bunch of silicon. Do we have silicon? We do. We do have some silicon. So, where do we want to start? Well, we're going to need to get the compressor, too, so we should start with trying to get that thing done. Now, can we use an electric compressor? I'm assuming we can use an electric compressor then. Oh, right, we need the regular one first to get to that. So we need some silicon. Oh, any type of silicon. Okay, that's cool. Silicon, redstone, redstone torch, and a diamond. Okay. Redstone torch. Now, does it consume it every time? Because that's that's going to be costly if it consumes it every time, man. That's just going to be very costly and very annoying if I have to do this every time. Silicon. Okay. Cool. Well, I guess we'll find out here. Diamond. Redstone. Redstone. Silicon.
baton. Boom, boom. All right, we are running. Is it going to consume all the resources though? Because that's quite expensive. It might not consume the torch, but these four might. We will see. Oh my God, it consumes everything, but I get three wafers in return. Okay, well I guess, I guess that's not too bad then. So we got aluminum, copper, and an anvil. Huh, this is the first time I think I've made an anvil now. Yeah, I don't have any. Anvil. Boom. Then we're going to need the, cup, the aluminum. And the copper, and then we'll be good. Alright, okay. Compressor. Or all right, cool. We have a compressor now. Now I don't, I don't think this really. Yeah, it doesn't matter where I put this because it has to be. Unfortunately, because it's not the electric compressor yet, it um, it isn't powered by electricity, so I can just put this really anywhere. So I'm just gonna, just gonna throw this down over here for right now, um, and it'll be powered by coal. Until we get the electric one. I will probably get the electric one eventually because that is quite annoying. And I don't want to have to power it with coal every time, but it is what it is. Alright. Well, I guess we can work towards the electric one right now. Because we'll, we'll need the advanced wafer, which, uh, oh, redstone repeater. Okay, well, I can make one of those. Redstone. I don't know why I'm searching for a redstone repeater. I know I don't have any of those. Redstone repeater. Boom. Diamond. Cool. Okay. And then we can chuck these in. Diamond repeater. Oh, I need some more redstone itself. I'll just take it out of there. <laughs> Whatever. I'll just take it out of there for right now. It's fine. It works. My bad. Shouldn't have put all the diamonds in. I don't think it would do anything, but don't want to worry about that anyway. Compressor. Don't like to have to type it out every time, but whatever. So I need compressed bronze and compressed steel. And our anvil wires aren't a problem. So how do I get compressed steel? Compressed iron and coal. Okay. So iron. Let's just do a bunch of iron then. Because we're probably going to need a bunch of that. So iron. Take all the iron. And compress it down. Does it use a coal for every one it does? Because if it does, that's not going to be very efficient. But it's going to be what it is, I guess. No, it doesn't. Alright, that's good then. I don't know how much it uses, but, you know, we'll see. We'll see how many it does. It's also very loud and annoying to a certain extent. Then bronze, which is tin and copper. Yeah, okay, which is that, and... Yeah, that. Okay. So, we need some copper. And tin. It might do... It might do eight just like a regular furnace, I'm assuming. Or no, it's it's going down pretty fast. No, it'll, it'll probably do eight. It'll probably do eight like a regular furnace. I would hope. Or is it only going to do seven? It might only do seven. No, it's still going. It's still going. Okay, cool. That is good. It does eight. So it's just like a regular furnace. That's that makes things a lot better for me. So now it's just kind of like the waiting here. Before we get the electric one. Oh, I can make another anvil. Um. Boom. Oh, I don't have any more iron. Cool. Our 
anvil. A bunch of compressed iron now, which is good. And then the steel is the iron with coal. So two more, then we're good. And then we can... I don't know, should we do the copper and then the other stuff too? Or what? I mean, it's just going to take a while. So maybe I should just cut until I have a bunch of the stuff here. Because we're going to do the copper now. that I'm like getting the max output of the stuff here. So I can chuck you back. Uh, don't know where you came from. <laughs> I don't know where that slab came from. Get more of the aluminum outputted here. And a little bit more made. I think I need aluminum for other stuff though, so I don't want um, make all of it. Okay, that should be good then with the aluminum. We got a bunch of it that we're making up here. The copper is almost done. So I think I'm going to go ahead and um, cut until I'm done with the tin or the bronze or something. Because again, this is this is kind of just tedious work here. Of just, you know, laying it all hammer away and compress down. Um, and then once it's done, we'll be in better shape. I'm also going to need some more coal. But we sh we have like... We have an abundance of coal here. We have 600 pieces of coal. We're not going to use it for much else anymore. Pretty much electricity for everything. So. Not going to be a problem. Oh, is this stacking up? It's okay right now? Yeah, I'm going to turn it off. You can use the energy in the buffer right now. Alright, um, you know, I said I was going to cut, and then I didn't ever cut, so let me go ahead and do that, and I'll be right back, okay? Alright, I am back, and everything is finished going th through the compression. We have the steel, we have the bronze. Um, I was also clearing out some stuff outside for where I'm going to do all this stuff, but, um, we can go ahead and make the electric compressor now. I made an iron anvil. Well, you saw me make that, so... Um, we now have the electric compressor. Huzzah! So, we can now put that one um, up here as well. Hopefully, it can go down like this. Uh, just turn off that. Nope, does not want to be that way. Okay, what what way what way do you want to be? Do you do you want to be like this? There you go. You you want to be like that. Okay. Whatever, dude. Whatever. Whatever floats your boat, Mr. Compressor, dude. Just stack them up like that, so that they kind of stay together with what there are, because they're both galactic craft stuff. So now we technically don't need this one. This one can go away. That was just to get the electric one basically up and running and um yeah next thing i need some blocks of iron like that oh, i don't know you can make slabs and then the compressed iron like that and we have a rocket launch pad we have nine of them which is what we will need eventually to launch the rocket when we eventually make it i'm going to have my launching platform over here it's gonna be kind of like, kind of like Cape Canaveral over here, man. You know, we got Cape Canaveral. This, this is basically our Cape Canaveral. So, um, unfortunately, it's kind of uneven, which is going to bug me. I'm going to admit it's going to bug me. Oh well, I can get rid of one part over here. 
So, two... Whatever, I don't care. I can I can edit it later, at a later time. Okay, one, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Cool. Launch pad. Ready to go. We are nowhere near getting the rocket ready to go, but at least the launch pad is there. Um, we need to make the NASA thing, um, the NASA workbench. That's what allows us to build the rocket. Um, we just have enough compressed steel, which is awesome. That's great. We now need our advanced wafer. So, um, redstone. Again, I should probably just keep some redstone with me. And then we need a repeater again, and then stone repeater. I think we might be running out of stones pretty soon. Oh, we're out of redstone torches, which I think I need some more of those. So. We'll make a bunch of these, because obviously this is a very common thing that we're going to be using, so we'll make 20 of these and chuck those in. Um, into here then, and then boom, 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 and there we go. And what else did we need? NASA... Okay, so we need lever and a redstone torch. So redstone torch. That other one is done now. We got two levers. Advanced wafer. Take that out. Boom, boom. We don't have a um, workbench. Really? Okay, fine. I can make one of those. Wood. Boom. We'll make a couple, because again, this might be something needed in some other type of recipe. You never know. Alright, we have a NASA workbench. Now, we're going to put this outside, because um, it's pretty big. And I really don't have much room inside for it, so we're going to put it right here. Oh, look at that. It's like all army and stuff. Look at that. Looks like something from Doc Ock in Spider-Man. Which is pretty cool. Um, okay, so we got a Tier 1 rocket ready to go. And that means we can start getting the next part of it done. Um, so, Tier 1 rocket. What do we need for a Tier 1 rocket? We need a nose cone, we need some fins, we need an engine, and we need a lot of heavy-duty plates. Heavy-duty plates is made from the steel, aluminum, and what was that? Was that bronze? Yeah, bronze. So, steel, aluminum, and bronze. We still have some bronze. Uh, we don't have any more steel, but we can make more steel. Then we need aluminum. So let's let's make some aluminum ones here. Then we can just chuck this stuff in. Like so. Don't have to worry about how much we put in at a time. And it'll just go. It's just electric. It'll just draw off of the generator out there. And do its thing. Oh, it makes double? Really? Oh my god, that's amazing. So this makes double. The electric compressor makes double. That is... That is sick. Oh, that is so sick. No, it just works double as fast. Oh, okay. Because, watch, I've got three... And then, watch... It'll go down to one. So it just works double as fast. Oh, that's cool, though. That's still cool. That's still really nice that it does that, because that... That... Lowers my wait time by a hell of a lot. Lowers it by a hell of a lot. Boom. Four. Oh. That's so good. That's so good right now. Um. So we can do that. Let's see if we can get, like, some of it done, maybe? What's the cone need? Oh, it just needs heavy duty and a redstone torch. 
Let's let's make that then. We can do that. The engines probably takes a lot. Oh wow, I don't even know what those things are. I don't even know what those things are. What do you want, sheep? Dude, we're gonna we're gonna go flying into space pretty soon, sheep. Are you ready for it? Are you ready to go fly into space? You you won't be coming with me unless unless I unless I put you in a critter cage and I take you with. I could do that. I could put you in a critter cage and take you with me. I could do that with you too, but I don't know. I don't think you guys would breathe up there. I don't think I can equip you guys with breathing materials. So it'd be a it'd be a very short experience for you. I can put storage space on the rocket, which is awesome. That's nice to have storage capacity. Almost done with this, and then I'll get the wafers done, and then get the some of it done, man. I mean, I didn't, again, I didn't actually expect us to get a lot of this done already in this first episode here, but I'm I'm not going to complain when we do. Man, that's, that's awesome. That is for sure awesome. Well, I can only make... Total of three though. Well, yeah, three. Because it's two layers, and yeah, it's three. Although, boom, makes them pretty fast. That's for sure. So I need more tin, and I need more copper. Tin. So we'll take two blocks of tin and uh, copper. Two blocks of copper. So we have that, and then that's aluminum. I need the tin. All right, so we have those three, and then we can get the um. Yeah, we can get the nose cone done now. Boom, nose cone. Let's go put it in to round out this episode. We have part of the rocket constructed. The nose cone part. Oh, it doesn't stay in? Oh, you have to do it all at once? Oh, okay. Well, that kind of sucks. I didn't know you had to do them all at once. Okay. Well, I guess... We'll just keep it in the chest over here and um, assemble it all when it is all done then. Yeah? Yeah, I guess so. So, uh, okay. I think that's where I'm going to wrap this episode up then, guys. Um, in the next one, we will try to maybe finish the rocket and be ready then maybe to head to the moon. If you enjoyed this episode, guys, please go ahead and leave a like, as well as any comments you may have down below. Otherwise, I'm KJ, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.